Hello, this is Joanna and I am recording this at night time. My book, Iamus, um, Reflections on Life and Living. <laughs> oh dear, there's a shine on my glasses. Anyway, here we go. It's 4th of June. I'm doing this really early in the morning because I <laughs> have to bring my daughter from place first and I won't have time to do it. So here we go. Fantasy and reality. What is fantasy and what is reality? Is not reality how we view it? And is not our own interpretation of it? And is that not a result of our world view? Which is a result of our conditioning and experience? Is not our conditioning based on someone else's fantasy? Does not our fantasy of today become our reality of tomorrow? Yes, that makes our ability to fantasize very important. We need to hand over our fantasies and our fantasizing of facility to God to be used in a creative and positive way. Imagining or fantasizing death, disease or disaster is not good. We do not want these things to come into being, so do not fantasize about them. Do not expect the worst or you will get it. Think only good for yourself and others. Ask God to put the right pictures in your mind about yourself, your future and others. There is a perfect self-expression for you. Ask God to give you a picture of this. Ask God to show you the way, one step at a time, to put you on the right path and to keep you on it. So this is my reading for June the 4th. So I wish you all very well today. I've had a very trying day today and tomorrow looks like it's going to be another day. That will challenge me. So I wish you all well.